you overlap. Yeah, that's true. Link has like six, so I'm a little bit spoiled. Link has six? Oh, that's right. Some of them have or more. five. I think Peach is five, yeah. Link has like red, blue, green, black, and white. Yeah. In Brawl, he also has like that yellow color, which is funny. I did not even know he had piss yellow. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right, but anyway. Going Battlefield. DC scripts is Donkey Kong as usual. Yeah. And uh, J Fox is Peach. I'm so glad there's like a regular DK player here. Because DK is cool. And, and PC Scribs is very good. You need that uh, low tier represent. Yeah. But it looks you like it's all about that. Looks like it's pretty even so far. Now, DK's usual barrage of up airs will be slightly as, less useful against Peach. Uh, against, for instance, Spacey's and Captain Falcon, like, he could just up air them endlessly. You know, especially on a stage like Battlefield where there's those handy platforms. But um, it's going to be hard to get away with against Peach. Yeah, he's going to have to be very good at spacing her. Yeah, not to mention he's such a huge target for her turnips, and that's going to make things a little bit difficult as well. As long as he can keep her in the air. Yeah, if, if Peach is above DK, then that's not a good sign. Ooh, that was a nice wait. But, ooh, that was a slightly mistimed forward air. It seems like DK's recovery uh, looks like it shouldn't be all too hard to edge guard, but once he, figured it, once he figures it out, I think he'll adapt to it and start doing a lot better against it. Yeah, Peach isn't throwing enough turnips. Off stage, it'll really mess with his recovery. Yeah. Lots of soft bears, but they're not doing anything. No kill moves yet. <laughs> what DI? Oh, oh my goodness! Right over the bear. <laughs> yeah, he needs he needs those turnips. Just cover those options. That was a nice wait. Man, he is such a Ooh, big target. Ooh, there we target. go. Yeah. There's that forward air. He set three stocks to three. Mm -hmm. Ooh. I have a feeling those down smashes are really going to come in handy. I mean, when do they? She hasn't hit him with them yet. Handy. Yeah, we'll see. Uh, there we then go. Then again, it is—it's a little bit scary to get close to DK because uh, getting grabbed is always a a concern. Yeah, Peach is not very good with the grab game, especially against Marth. So I wonder if he's going to incorporate more of those. There we go. Down smash, whittling down the shield. Oh, advertising his cheesesteak special. Yeah, I don't blame him. That cheesesteak special. Oh, they are so good. That's the only reason you should come here. $4 cheesesteak with a drink. Yeah, like this tournament should be called Cheesesteak Special at the break. <laughs> Instead cheese of Smash at the Break. Cheesesteak Fridays. Cheesesteak Friday. Oh my god, that's the best. What Why can't this be called the Cheesesteak Weekly? What is this called? Like it's, it's just called like Smash at the Break or whatever. Yeah, Jackson, like we're renaming it. <laughs> Peach, walking. Jaxo. Jaxo. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> we're streaming. We're streaming at uh in Dunnellan or Dunnellan. Sorry, Dunnellan, Dunnellan, New Jersey, a place I've never heard of except for <laughs> this one location, which is an arcade called Eight on the Break. It's a really amazing arcade. One the of the only one in New Jersey that's the legitimately yeah, an arcade. Yeah, the only legit arcade in New Jersey, which is like quarter coin operated machines that you play for fun. What is it? They have an ITG machine here, hacked up the hizzle with like 1,500 songs. They have all your favorite fighting games, your rhythm games, and uh, a lot more. Plus the cheesesteak specials. So of if course. you're in the area, you should definitely check this place out. If not for Smash, just to uh, you know come here and chill. Eight Way Brig, and our stream is uh, Twitch TV slash Eight Way Run. 8wayrun.tv 8wayrun.tv, sorry. Okay. We got go. our own site now. <laughs> uh, Alright, so it's still 2-2. Two -two. Yeah. Donkey's looking bad. Yeah, J-Fox with a, with a bit of a lead here. Ooh. What's the score? The score? It's still a 0-0. Zero zero. Yeah. See, yeah, once he has that recovery figured out, he's just going to be able to keep, uh, what is it, keep DC off stage. Yeah, no. he was able to up over that bear last time. Like, I would say... Characters who have not many offstage options and try uh, facing DK's recovery offstage are going to have trouble uh, because th DK's arms just have such a big hitbox. But for someone like Peach, who has not only the turnips but also the float, you know, back airs and down airs, for instance, uh, which cover a lot of where DK's arms Oof. are not. Whiffed. Yeah, that's tough. Yeah, it looks like J Fox is going to pull through on this one. Yeah, once he figured out he can just run away from DK and pull turnips and shield grabs, of course. Yeah, he's pulling many more turnips now, especially when he's on the ledge. He's uh, applying that sort of pressure definitely adequately. There we go. Ooh, Ooh, barely missed the forward missed. air, but I'm sure it won't be long at this point. PC Scrib needs a good spike in. Maybe he'll have a chance. Maybe. He's yeah, not never, caught any of these turnips either. Never doubt the comeback. DK is very good at catching because it's big hitbox, too. Oh, really? That helps? 
Uh, the grab hitbox is what they use, I think. Oh, I see. That's where the hands are. That's cool. So I don't know why he's not grabbing somewhere. I don't know. Grabbing them is kind of like uh, yeah. fickle in general. Like, you don't want to rely on that, in my opinion. Yeah, it's like power shielding. Kind of. Oh, that was a stitch. That but was. It doesn't even <laughs> matter. Took it with two stocks. J Fox takes it. 1 0. 1 0. At the Cheesesteak by Weeklies. <laughs> Yo, Jack, so we're renaming your tournament to okay. the Cheesesteak by Weeklies. Oh, okay. We gotta get a melee reference in there. The, uh. Nah, I'll think of a pun later. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thinking of a counter pick? What's he going? Dreamland, I would not have picked. obviously. Let's everyone take Peach to Dreamland. It's the best stage to play against Peach. I prefer Battlefield with Peach now. Dreamland is really boring as Peach, honestly. Well, <laughs> when you're talking tournament... When you're in a tournament, yeah, it doesn't matter. I mean, why do you think people play as Jigglypuff? Of course. Oh. Mar oh, that Mars. That, like, 13-year-old Falco. However old he is. He looks 13. <laughs> he's really good. Really? Well, he's good enough to eliminate me pretty fast out of losers last time. Ah, uh, I'm a little bit, uh... <laughs> Oh, I'm on stream. All See right. you guys later. Good luck, dude. Wait, you're not on stream. You have a match. That's what you mean. All right. Oh, well. Right back to Battlefield. I think that's a solid choice. I don't even know who United is. Ooh. <laughs> that whiffed grab. DK counters with his much longer range grab. Yeah. I got a few minutes. That forward air. Just throwing that forward air. Ooh, ooh, tough position. Is this it? Oh, man. That's Juke so hard out. to... There's so many mix-ups with that parasol, but I if, love you it. Just, if you grab the ledge at the perfect time against it, then they just float to their death. I used to whine all the time. Like, I have no recovery option against Marth. Once I figured out you could juke up and down with that umbrella. Oh, yeah. Oh, there oh, we go. There the hitbox on it is weird with Battlefield. You have to be way above the ledge. Cheryl Ford, there probably will not be a Project M side event. Usually, uh, like, we've run Project M a couple times, and generally the tournament runs way too late. Like, if there were fewer people, but there's like 25 people or so. More TVs, too. Yeah, we don't also don't have enough TVs. Oh, is this my opponent? What's your name? What's your name? I'll just keep waiting. I'll be here, I'll wait. Yeah, we might have a PM set up later. I'm not sure if it'll be uh, the one on the stream, but if there's like some time after the tournament, we might do some friendlies. So we'll see. Ooh, beautiful DI. He didn't get killed by that. Does oh no, missed the Nair. Ooh, makes it back. This is tough. That's it. Yeah. I'm surprised he took him back to Battlefield. I'm not too surprised. I actually don't know anything about DK stages. Ooh. Well, Battlefield is definitely better than Final Destination. Uh, yeah. I don't know. Yoshi's maybe, but... Yoshi's really messed with Peach. Ooh, Ooh. that was very nice. Aided that shield, though. Who is United? United? Yeah. Where? No, who? I'm asking who United is because this one person won't leave me alone until I tell United his base and he's beautiful. Um, I don't usually like to pander to those types of people, but uh, he's beautiful, I guess. <laughs> I'm saying, yeah, but whatever. Uh, looks like my brother's sent straight to losers. Nice. That's what he gets for not playing with me. <laughs> Scribs is doing better this time. Yeah, and she's figuring out the turnips. He's just got a combo into that punch. Ooh! <laughs> misses it every time. I don't think he can really combo into it against Peach. Yeah, she's too floaty. But in right. any case, he's doing much better. He's He has a full stock lead now. And he's keeping that lead. That back air. Soft bit. It's tough from this point. He's, got He's probably going to sneak a ledge grab in. Yep. Oh, oh, man. He barely got knocked off, though. The little umbrella. The slash box. Oh, man. Two stocks ahead now. Need your key? 
You're leaving? No, you're still in. You two eliminations. Here we go. The up airs. Up air. Up air. Oh, that must have been a... I want to see a spike somewhere in here. Oh, that's going to be hard. Nah, he got it. That platform. Uh, it's the best platform on Battlefield. Yeah. The top one I could do without. <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh. Not good DI. What a punching bag. Then again, when you're so gigantic, yeah, it's going to be hard to... You can't even DI like out of that. <laughs> <laughs> toad off stage that toad all stall. the time. I got to incorporate some toad into my game. Uh, no, you don't. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, that was a good shield hookup smash. Yeah, I didn't think it would reach. I usually practice on here. Hmm. Oh. There we go. Is this a comeback? Wait, is this a comeback? Scribs versus... Yeah, Scribs is Donkey Kong. Ooh, good turn up. This could be a comeback. I think he missed the old cancel. Oh, <laughs> wow, nice. against the stage. That was amazing. I don't think I've ever seen that on a uh, battlefield. Yeah. That hitbox with Peach is hard to work with. You gotta find out where she's facing and then what part of the dress. Yeah. She's slowly racking up small bits of damage though as she's making oh this comeback, so we'll see what happens. All he needs uh -oh. Oh, one he needs good the hit. Edge guard. Ooh, that's tough. That dash dance. <laughs> I wasn't even sure what he was doing for a DK second. DK dash dancing. It, I think it's like pretty reasonably legit. It's not like Bowser. It's not like Link's. <laughs> Dude, what are you talking <laughs> about? I'm dash dancing with Link? Uh, it's funny. It's like a little trot, the fox trot. Oh! Oh! She air dodges on. Come on! Still gets get this edge guard. Oh no! The problem is, uh, I mean, J Fox is floating when he's at the ledge, but then when uh, Scripps goes for like a high recovery, for instance, he he doesn't have the mobility because he's floating. It's all right. He's got a whole stock to get one good solid hit on her. Oh, and that could have been it. <laughs> and here we go. Oh. Such a floaty. This is so. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, there, there go. it is. One single hit, yeah. One one. He got a shield. All right. Tied it up. A <laughs> six minute match. Definitely wow. that adaptation and then the counter adaptation. Counter going adaptation? On. Yeah. DK evolves. Mega Donkey Kong. <laughs> They're yelling about how long it was. Well, yeah. Six, six minutes. That happens in a lot of like Peach versus X unknown, unknown character <laughs> where they have to adapt on the fly. Uh. All right. Taking a break. I wonder what stage they're going. Battlefield again? I doubt it, actually. Seven <laughs> matches have gone by since that last match on stream. If That's pretty funny. I think Final Destination would be smart. But I'd like to see Yoshi. Although what, just to c consolidate the match, make it a little okay, less lengthy. Make it a little shorter, get some Randall action in there. <laughs> Jaxel's threatening to punch quite a bunch of us. Uh oh. Oh, found the dreams. This is gonna be good. High ceiling though, this is gonna be good for Peach. I always forget this stage exists in tournaments. Because nobody wants it. <laughs> yeah. Up, oh, I'm up. <laughs> see you guys later. Hey yo, you up over here. I'm curious to see how he plans on uh, taking advantage of this stage. Because we still have the platforms here, meaning uh, the Scribs can really get in those up airs. Of course, when they disappear on the sides, but... Uh, stage preference always overrides character matchup on stages, technically. Who whiffed up B. He was definitely going for that uh, strong initial up B hitbox, but that's all right. That's it. that's the awesome thing. It's a lot like Bowser's up B. Even if you don't hit that initial initial hitbox, it's still kind of very safe. You could just sort of drift away, and it's really hard for them to get in, for instance, to grab or a punish because your arms are flying all over the place. Ooh, that was good. That back air is, is swift. And powerful. This could be the stock. Ooh. Oh, that was really interesting, but it could have uh, granted J Fox some recovery here. There we go. Ooh. Ooh, that was so good. 
I'm sure uh, J Fox was getting ready to shield grab, for instance, but uh, that upbeat came out too quickly. Scraves is just really rocking the spacing here. Spacing those back airs, getting in like safe moves on shield. It's really making the difference. And uh, I think he's doing better with recovery again as well. Yeah, definitely. He's being really tricky uh, with his with the drifting and his up B. <laughs> oh man, I wish that back air hit. That would have been great. But he has a reasonably solid lead at this point anyway. Um, and in in a matchup like this where it's all about the neutral game spacing hits, that is, I, w I would call this a pretty solid lead. You know, as opposed to when you see Spacey's Marth and Cheek and, you know, stocks can just fly around left and right. Uh, this is a much more patient game. So uh, not, I would call 93% very significant. <laughs> Until the down smashes come out. Oh, man. Wow, he went out there. Oh, my goodness. That'll be. I can't believe that, that uh, took the stock. <laughs> Gorgeous. Like, I'm loving this DK. Just, he's picking so many amazing options. I love it. Yeah, DC scripts is DK. Yeah, three stocks to one. Oh, I don't think it was fully charged. It only did 14%. That's all right. Yeah, he's definitely uh, that counter adaptation. Another back air. We gonna see it? Yep, there it is. But Peach's crazy recovery. Gonna get her back on. Ooh, those those grounded up bees are just really doing it for him. Uh oh, that was risky. Ate the grab. Ooh, is that a stitch? <laughs> oh, that get up attack. Found a dream's high ceiling. Another get up attack. Looking for those back airs. There we go. That's it. Ah, good job, DC. Closed that out really nicely. And I'm going to get my stake, so I'll be right back.